Well, folks, uh, tour event here in Olympia. I'm getting my March uh, YouTube album of uh, cover songs ready for uh, for the month here. It's the 3rd uh, of March, uh, Friday. Uh, I'm, uh, my voice is kind of messed up. I've got a dry airway and a partially paralyzed uh, vocal cords and... Uh, Eyes a little bit out of focus. My hearing's dimmed. Uh, too many casual exposures to dope, and I'm sitting here handling this uh, this smartphone that I use for a recording device, and it's got comes out of a THC house. The person that records my videos uh, has got a lot of heavy con dope contamination in a house, and uh, if I don't get it cleaned off the phone, I've got this thing up near my face, and it's drugging me continuously. So, but I've got to get these things out. Uh, once in a while, I get a song that uh, that I didn't. I never wrote it down, but I know the words to it. And this is uh, called "Dear Gods" by Patsy Cline. Uh, she was headed for great greatness. She was already great, and she died in 1959 in a small train crash. And you can see that. And uh, and uh, well, let's see how it turns out here. <coughs> Boy, when I get that phone up close to my face, my voice starts going croaky. I start sounding like a like a sick frog. Yeah. I go to church on a Sunday, and the vows that I made. I break them on Monday The rest of the week I'll do as I please But come Sunday morning I pray on my knees Dear God, I know I'm not worthy Won't you hurry and help me turn back from the path I have trod? You'll never be sorry, dear God. Playing the guitar too loud because my hearing's depressed. My voice won't project because my airway is dry and my vocal cords are partially paralyzed. the carryings on of some of our neighbors, cheating and lying and forgetting the faith, yet we have the nerve to ask if it's too you hurry and help me turn back from the path I have trod. You'll never be sorry, dear God. I think I I think I should have quit after the first one and uh, got that phone on drug because I'm a uh, I sound like I've got tuberculosis <laughs> or throat cancer. <laughs> yeah. That's what that dope will do for you. If I'll tell you, friends, my Facebook and YouTube friends, if you're not on common dope, don't get on it. Don't let nobody talk you into it because uh, I've never known anybody that could get off of it and the concentration that comes in now. It's uh, totally addictive. It's totally a gateway drug. All those people that's laying up drugged in the woods and overdosing and shooting each other and stealing cars and catalytic converters and robbing stores. <laughs> They're, they all started with marijuana. It was the biggest lie going around that it's not a gateway drug. It's definitely a gateway drug. Everybody I know that knows anything about dope says it's a gateway drug. So uh, don't get on it. Uh, 
Don't you believe all that advertising they put on the radio and television, how good it is? It, it's not the greatest gift of mankind since God invented the Bible. I can guarantee you that. I've known too many people that's on it, and, and they're all a bunch of losers, and uh, and and they're going to be that way. Uh, they're gonna, the last thing they do before they die is get high. So they're going to take a hit on the on the dope pipe, so uh, uh, don't get on it. Uh, take it from an old man. I'm 80 years old, and uh, I've given you good advice. You may not believe me, but thank you for listening.